I bet you didn't know that tiny crystals could cause big pain. Yes, you heard that right. These minuscule, almost invisible crystals can wreak havoc in your body, leading to excruciating pain that can disrupt your daily life. Imagine something so small causing such a significant impact. It's almost unbelievable, but it's true. These crystals are the culprits behind a condition known as gout. Yep, we're talking gout. Gout is not just a minor inconvenience. It's a serious condition that can affect your quality of life. It's a type of arthritis. But unlike other forms of arthritis that might develop gradually, gout can strike suddenly and with a vengeance. One moment you're fine, and the next, you're in severe pain. It's a condition that demands attention and understanding. Gout is a type of arthritis that happens when uric acid builds up in your blood. Uric acid is a waste product that your body produces when it breaks down substances called purines. Normally, uric acid dissolves in your blood, passes through your kidneys, and is excreted in your urine. However, when your body produces too much uric acid, or your kidneys excrete too little, it can build up and form sharp, needle-like crystals in a joint or surrounding tissue, causing pain, inflammation, and swelling. This acid forms sharp crystals in your joints, often your big toe. The big toe is a common site for gout attacks, but it can also affect other joints such as the ankles, knees, elbows, wrists, and fingers. The pain can be so intense that even the weight of a bed sheet can be unbearable. The affected joint becomes red, hot, swollen, and extremely tender. It's a condition that can make even the simplest movements excruciatingly painful. Ouch! The pain of a gout attack is often described as a burning sensation, as if the joint is on fire. It's a pain that can wake you up in the middle of the night and make it difficult to go back to sleep. The affected joint can feel like it's being crushed or stabbed with needles. It's a pain that can make you dread the next attack and take steps to prevent it. Most people get gout from eating too many purine-rich foods. Purines are natural substances found in many foods, and when your body breaks them down, it produces uric acid. While purines are found in many foods, some foods are particularly high in purines and can increase your risk of gout if consumed in large quantities. Think red meat, shellfish, and sugary drinks. These foods are high in purines and can contribute to the buildup of uric acid in your blood. Red meat such as beef, lamb, and pork is particularly high in purines. Shellfish, such as shrimp, lobster, and crab, are also high in purines. Sugary drinks, especially those sweetened with high fructose corn syrup, can increase uric acid levels and trigger gout attacks. Your body turns purines into uric acid. When you consume foods high in purines, your body breaks them down into uric acid. Normally, this uric acid is dissolved in your blood and excreted in your urine. However, when you consume too many purine-rich foods, your body produces more uric acid than it can excrete leading to a buildup of uric acid in your blood. Too much of it, and bam! The excess uric acid can form sharp needle-like crystals in your joints, leading to a sudden and severe gout attack. The pain can come on suddenly, often at night, and can be so intense that it wakes you up from a deep sleep. The affected joint becomes red, hot, swollen, and extremely tender. It's a pain that can make even the simplest movements excruciatingly painful. Gout attack. A gout attack can last for days or even weeks, and the pain can be so severe that it can make it difficult to walk or even stand. The affected joint can become so swollen and tender that even the lightest touch can be unbearable. It's a condition that can significantly impact your quality of life and make it difficult to perform everyday activities. But don't worry, there are steps you can take to prevent gout attacks and manage the condition. By making some simple lifestyle changes, you can reduce your risk of gout and improve your overall health. You can prevent gout by drinking lots of water. Staying hydrated helps your kidneys flush out uric acid from your body, reducing the risk of crystal formation in your joints. Aim to drink at least 8 glasses of water a day, and more if you're physically active or live in a hot climate. Drinking water can also help you maintain a healthy weight, which is another important factor in preventing gout. Eating more fruits and veggies. A diet rich in fruits and vegetables can help reduce your risk of gout. Fruits and vegetables are low in purines and high in vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants that can help reduce inflammation and improve your overall health. 
Some fruits, such as cherries, have been shown to reduce uric acid levels and lower the risk of gout attacks. Aim to fill half your plate with fruits and vegetables at every meal. And cutting back on alcohol and sugary drinks. Alcohol, especially beer and spirits, can increase uric acid levels and trigger gout attacks. Sugary drinks, such as soda and fruit juice, can also increase uric acid levels and contribute to weight gain, which is a risk factor for gout. Limiting your intake of alcohol and sugary drinks can help reduce your risk of gout and improve your overall health. Also, maintaining a healthy weight helps a ton. Being overweight or obese increases your risk of gout, as excess weight can lead to higher levels of uric acid in your blood. Losing weight can help reduce your uric acid levels and lower your risk of gout attacks. Aim to achieve and maintain a healthy weight through a combination of a balanced diet and regular physical activity. Even a small amount of weight loss can make a big difference in reducing your risk of gout. So, next time you reach for that steak or soda, think about the impact it could have on your joints. Making smarter food choices can help you prevent gout and improve your overall health. It's not about completely eliminating your favorite foods, but rather enjoying them in moderation and making healthier choices most of the time. Remember your joints will thank you for making smarter choices. Your joints will appreciate the effort you put into making healthier choices. By choosing a salad over a steak or water over soda, you're taking steps to reduce your risk of gout and improve your overall health. It's about making small, sustainable changes that can have a big impact on your health and well-being. Stay healthy. Stay happy. Taking care of your health is important and making small changes to your diet and lifestyle can help you stay healthy and happy. By staying hydrated, eating a balanced diet, and maintaining a healthy weight, you can reduce your risk of gout and enjoy a better quality of life. Remember, your health is in your hands, and making smart choices today can lead to a healthier and happier tomorrow. That's gout in 60 seconds. We've covered a lot of information in a short amount of time, but the key takeaways are simple. Stay hydrated, eat a balanced diet, maintain a healthy weight, and limit your intake of alcohol and sugary drinks. By following these tips, you can reduce your risk of gout and enjoy a healthier life. Hit like and subscribe for more quick health tips. If you found this information helpful, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more quick health tips. We're here to help you stay informed and make healthier choices. Thanks for watching and stay healthy. Chapter 2 Understanding Gout Symptoms Gout symptoms can be sudden and severe. They often include intense joint pain, inflammation, and redness. The most commonly affected joint is the big toe, but gout can occur in any joint. Let's break down the symptoms you need to be aware of. First, the pain. Gout pain typically starts suddenly and often at night. It can be so intense that even the weight of a bedsheet can be unbearable. This pain can last for days or even weeks, and it tends to be most severe within the first 12 to 24 hours after it begins. Next, inflammation and redness. The affected joint becomes swollen, warm, and red. The skin around the joint may appear shiny and may peel as the swelling goes down. This inflammation is not just painful but can make the joint difficult to move. Finally, limited range of motion. As gout progresses, you may find it difficult to move the affected joint normally. This can significantly impact your ability to perform everyday activities. Recognizing these symptoms early can help you manage gout more effectively. If you experience sudden severe joint pain, especially in your big toe, consult a healthcare professional immediately. Early diagnosis and treatment can help prevent gout attacks and reduce the risk of long-term joint damage. Stay tuned for more tips on managing and preventing gout. And don't forget to hit like and subscribe for more quick health tips. Chapter 3. Gout Triggers and Risk Factors Gout can be triggered by various factors including diet, alcohol consumption, and certain medical conditions. High levels of uric acid in the blood are a primary risk factor. Let's dive deeper into what can set off a gout attack. First, diet. Consuming foods high in purines, such as red meat, shellfish, and certain types of fish, can increase uric acid levels in the blood. These elevated levels can crystallize in the joints, causing intense pain and inflammation. Next, alcohol consumption. Drinking alcohol, especially beer and spirits, can interfere with the body's ability to eliminate uric acid, 
leading to its buildup. This is why moderation is key if you're prone to gout attacks. Certain medical conditions can also increase your risk. Conditions like hypertension, diabetes, and kidney disease can affect how your body processes uric acid. Being aware of these conditions and managing them effectively can help reduce your risk. Other risk factors include obesity, family history of gout, and even certain medications like diuretics and low-dose aspirin. Understanding these triggers and risk factors is essential for preventing gout attacks and maintaining a healthy lifestyle. Remember, knowledge is power. By being aware of what can trigger gout, you can take proactive steps to manage your condition. For more tips on managing and preventing gout, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Chapter 4. Gout Treatment and Prevention When it comes to treating gout, there are several options available to help manage pain and inflammation. Medications play a crucial role in providing relief. Non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, NSAIDs, corticosteroids, and colchicine are commonly prescribed to reduce the pain and swelling associated with gout attacks. It's important to consult with a healthcare professional to determine the best medication for your specific needs. Beyond medication, lifestyle changes are essential for preventing future gout attacks. Staying hydrated is one of the simplest yet most effective measures. Drinking plenty of water helps to flush out excess uric acid from the body, reducing the risk of crystal formation in the joints. Maintaining a healthy diet is equally important. Incorporate more low purine foods such as fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and lean proteins into your meals. Avoiding or limiting foods high in purines like red meat and shellfish can make a significant difference. Additionally, reducing alcohol intake, particularly beer and spirits, can help manage uric acid levels. Regular exercise and maintaining a healthy weight can also lower the risk of gout attacks. Physical activity helps improve overall health and can aid in weight management, reducing the strain on your joints. Remember, managing gout is a combination of medical treatment and lifestyle adjustments. By taking these proactive steps, you can effectively control your condition and lead a healthier, more comfortable life. For more tips on managing and preventing gout, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell.